Good afternoon, my name is Jeremiah with Affordable Mobility Solutions. Today I'm shooting a video of our 2016 Chrysler Pacifica. You can see with the touch of the key fob here, I can operate both sliding doors and the rear trunk hatch. The ramp itself is a manual ramp, very easy, to, very easy to operate, very low cost to maintain. I can operate this entire ramp using just two fingers. It's got these clamps on here to keep the ramp from rattling. It's a great design, just like so. Got a handle on either side, driver or passenger side. Take this down to the ground. The ramp itself is 34 inches wide, which is two inches wider, I'm sorry, four inches wider than the side entries. Down here at the base, it does taper down to 32 inches. It's got eight tie down points, so you can get up to two wheelchairs at a time in here, or a gurney, or a stretcher. Now it's got the easy lock, the quick lock in here. It's about a $2,000 upgrade. Put a pin on the bottom of your chair, lock right into there. So, very nice, very, very nice thing to have, very convenient. Dash looks great, steering wheel controls so you can keep your eyes on the road. Got the backup camera, dual climate control, rear air. Got the uh, cup holder center console there. Got your rear, rear air controls back here as well. If you ever you want to use, let's say, a taxi cab, you can hit the off button there. It makes these doors manual. And they'll slide right shut. If you want to turn the power back on, you can do it like that. And the power doors will work again. So, pretty simple stuff. When it comes time to shut the ramp down, come back here, lift with one finger is all it takes. Latch it down, and you're ready to roll. You can also shut the trunk latch there, just like so. Quick walk around, very clean. It's in excellent condition. It's got the alloy wheels, Firestone tires, the rear are about 5, 30 seconds. The front are about seven, so still some, some decent tread left on them. Got a little bit of a scuff right there. Probably gonna have my people put some put some touch-up paint on that. Tinted windows in the rear. Overall, the body's very clean. And it does show a little bit of oxidation. This is very common on the Dodge Chrysler hoods. I want you to see this, it's not a big deal. If I pull back, you're not even gonna notice it. And almost all the older ones have that. Uh, the only difference is I'm honest enough to tell you about it. So but overall, the body's very clean. I'm very impressed with it. Very nice looking vehicle. The roof looks good. As far as the interior, we always show you the VIN number. That way you know we've got this vehicle in our possession. We're not trying to pull some internet scam. And speaking of that VIN number, and I want to apologize. Uh, this is actually, it's a 2017 was purchased in 2016 by 2017 they, they didn't even make these in 2016 so uh, no accidents or damage reported just two owners and a personal vehicle last owned in Tennessee so it's not not a rusted out area and I'll show you the undercarriage but has a Carfax guarantee of no salvage junk rebuilt fire flood hail or lemon on, on the title no total loss no structural damage no airbags deployed odometer checks out good no accidents reported and no open recall. So what we're, exactly what we're looking for, you can see the service records on there. So I just wanted to show you that Carfax and all the vehicles on our website come with a free Carfax report as well. As far as the rest of the interior of the vehicle, very clean. I'm a non-smoker. I can smell sm smoke from a mile away. No signs of smoke or any unusual odors in the Pacifica. Very clean interior. Has your Sino console there for all your drinks. The dash looks great, as I've already showed you. These rear seats look to be in excellent condition. They will fold down. Uh, if you want to make them collapse up on their sides, uh, we can do that. That is obviously, it's an upgrade. And it's got the uh, one key if you want us to get additional key, key made on your dime. Let us know. Uh, but to push button start, nice feature to have. If the, uh, if the vehicle's if we, on the easy lock here, you have to shut that off every time you get in. What that tells you that no one's locked into that lock. So if you had one of your family back here and you thought they were locked into there, and you hear that beep, it means they are not locked in. It's a safety feature. So a nice safety feature to have. Current mile is 66,132. You can see there's no check engine lights, no airbag, no ABS lights. Got the backup camera there. And we, uh, let me, before I pop the hood, we check the power windows, power locks, heat, air, cruise. Mirror over there. This is not some vehicle you buy or you come and look at. And it's got a bunch of issues we didn't tell you about. You'll notice a lot of car dealers, they, they pick and choose what they want you to know about the vehicle. They do certain camera angles so you can't see a big dent in the door. 
they don't tell you about the check engine light on or the transmission slipping or the knock in the suspension that's why i make these videos that's why i'm shooting you straight that's why i'm letting you know exactly what i see because i'm not i'm certainly not trying to waste your time or mine underneath it is a 3.6 v6 engine idle smoothly no signs of any damage no signs of any leaks no signs of any abnormal rust or anything like that this is exactly what we're looking for in a used vehicle I uh, show up top the vehicle emissions as well are right there and I crawl underneath the van you'll see much of the same very clean no signs of any bent metal no signs of any leaks there's a spot back there the air conditioner dripping down that's normal everything looks good and you know someone who buys and sells cars all the time and, and sees people buying and selling the number one mistake people make when buying a used vehicle they assume things they assume because it's got low miles they assume because it's relatively new um, they assume that it runs and drives good they assume that it's not all rusted out and you'll notice our competition go back and look at their pictures go back and look at their pages how many times do they show you the undercarriage of a vehicle and there's a reason behind that they buy a lot of these from new york and chicago to buy ones that have been in accidents they don't want you to see what's going on underneath you know it's a little bit of surface rust is to be expected on a four four year old almost five year old vehicle that's normal everything under here looks good and you know what i recommend to people is demand a detailed video like this if someone's going to sell you a vehicle for 20 30 40 50 thousand dollars of your hard-earned money possibly of your life savings tell them to get off their behind tell them to get out and make a detailed video like this that you're going to settle for nothing less and if you do settle for something less and the vehicle shows up to your house and it's not what you expected well you really only have yourself to blame People get burned on the internet every single day. Don't be one of them. Demand a detailed video. Okay, the final portion of the video. I always like to get the vans out on the test drive so you can hear the engine run, feel the transmission shift through all the gears. And you know that whether you come in and drive this van home or take advantage of our affordable shipping, uh, free shipping in the lower 48 states that we've done our due diligence. We've made sure this van is roadworthy. You can see the steering wheel is nice and straight, no unusual vibration or noise. That's exactly what we're looking for. With all this being said, please understand this is a used vehicle. We strongly recommend an affordable extended warranty with every used vehicle. Talk to me about that. I can go over some options with you anywhere as short as 90 days, all the way up to eight years. So protect your investment, folks. It's a great idea. You're gonna spend thousands of dollars on a mobility van, at least spend a couple hundred dollars protecting it. Also keep in mind, I know that there's a lot of people out there selling mobility vans, I get it. Uh, we have over 800 reviews on eBay. All 800 left us positive feedback. We've had zero negative feedback. That's 800 people said we did them right. Zero people said we did them wrong. We have a 4.7 out of 5 stars on Google. Look us up. We've got a great reputation. We make these videos. We provide a free Carfax. Nobody in the country, and I mean nobody, that goes out of their way. Make sure, what, make sure you know exactly what you're getting goes the extra mile like affordable mobility solutions also keep in mind we don't have any hidden fees a lot of these dealers out there have a real nice price online then you factor in administrative fees tag fees document fees just fees 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 they don't tell you about and then you factor in shipping the next thing you know that nice price is up two or three thousand dollars in extra fees and shipping the price you see is shipped to your front door so don't be fooled by all the gimmicks these other dealers play you know my question to you is if someone's not going to tell you the real price and if someone tells me it's $10,000, wait a minute, let me break here. Nice hard break. No grinding, no squeaking, no unusual brake noise or vibration. So again, exactly what we're looking for. And back to my point, if someone tells me something's $10,000, yes, I know I might have to pay sales tax, but I expect it to be $10,000. Not $300 a year, $500 a year, $99 a year, $49 a year. Now, if someone's not gonna be honest with me about the actual price of what they're selling, what else are they hiding? Are they hiding flood damage? Are they hiding title issues? Are they hiding mechanical issues? I just don't like doing business with people that aren't honest. Maybe you do, and that's for you to decide. It's your money. And hey, if you want to give us a call, 316-262-VANS. That's 316-262-8267. My name is Jeremiah. If you're more of a text messenger, give me a text. 316-518-4377. You've now got the owner's cell phone number. I want you to call one of those big mobility works or Braun or VMI companies or Freedom Motors and I want you to ask them, hey, can I have the owner's cell phone number? 
That way if there's ever any issues, I have any problems, I can just call and talk to the owner. I don't have to call and talk to five different people and get put on hold, end up in somebody's voicemail and never get a call back. I can just reach out to Jeremiah, he'll take care of me. So see if the competition is as committed to customer service as we are. I'd be interested to know what they say. And we do have financing available. We can send an application to your phone. We can take one over the phone. We can send an application to your email. Let us know how we can help. And check out our entire inventory. Uh, vehicles all with Carfax report, all with detailed videos at www.mobility316.com. That's mobility316.com. And as always, thank you so much for checking out Affordable Mobility Solutions, where mobility is affordable. Call us today.